Howdy y'all and welcome to Ark Survival Evolved with the Butcher Man. We're about to have some fun. I wasn't actually planning on recording right now, but I was flying around looking at some stuff and I seen this guy just hanging out on the beach. Wild female pterodon. Level 120. This is gonna be this is gonna be a chase, I think. Whoop, missed. I ain't about to wait for you to come down, girlfriend. I can hit her. Do you sink? Whoops. That was my bird. Come on now. Really? You're gonna land right away? I wanna get on this side. I need her to go inland. Come on. I missed. Come on, Phoenix. We gotta chase this bird. Come on, Pterodon. Just, just calm down and go down and land. You're okay. No big deal. You see that one sticking out of its foot? I swear it looks like there's one sticking out of its foot. That desync sometimes, man. It'll get you. This is hard doing by yourself. This pterodon, though, seems pretty prone to be on the ground. Or at least near the ground. Let's see if we can get a shot on it again. Where'd you go? Come on. Missed. Go down. Go down. Not in the water. Don't go over the water. That's dangerous. been wondering something though that if you knock a uh, if you knock an animal out and it lands in the water could you manually give it Lazarus chowder this if this pterodon happens to land in the water we're gonna try it I've made some and another miss it knocked out bro How many arrows is this thing gonna take? It should have knocked out by now, I would think. I can't see you through the trees. Come on. Go back out to the beach so I can see you. Only got nine arrows left. This thing seems to want to land. There's no way it's out of stamina. Yeah, I got you. Okay, I got you. I'm a little busy at the moment. Where did it go? I'm betting it's on the ground somewhere. I don't think it's knocked out. Pretty much can't be. There it is. Oh, it's knocked out. It's knocked out. Good deal. Kill that Dilo, Phoenix. Kill all the Dilos, Phoenix. Come on, Phoenix, kill him. Oh, it got knocked out. Oh, it's a female. Oh, wait, I need a male. Never mind. Come here, Phoenix. The problem I have now is that I have dodo eggs, but it's it's not made. That stuff's not made. Um, I need five, and I was gonna make it earlier, but then I'm just like, well, you know, maybe. Um, what do I do? Um, let's see. 
hate leaving it, but we're gonna have to. I hate leaving it in the woods. I was hoping it'd land on the beach. Um, let's see. I got a little bit. I know I do. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think I should have enough time to do some fence foundations. And then... If, tell you what, we're just going to run back to base really quick and hope that we can get back here. Okay, so it's straight toward the red obelisk. I'm going to go do this and then I'm going to come back as long as I can find it. And we're back. Okay, so it has not been that long. I actually rushed over there, threw everything in the pot. Started the fire, went to run off, forgot a couple of things, went back, threw some stuff in the pot, uh, built a bunch of fence foundations and wall stuff really quick, flew over here, put them down, then ran back over there, and I'm just like, my wife was even standing here, and she's like laughing, because I'm like freaking out trying to get this bird. And uh, I said, well, as long as, uh, as long as I did everything right, there should be food, bird food in this pot. And I went and looked. And there was bird food in the pot. And according to the calculator, it should only take five. So, um, let me grab some berries. Just, or not berries, meat. Let's grab some meat right quick. Just in case. Because I don't want it to, like, not tame. That's for sure. But it should only take the five. Hopefully. Okay, I got in there once. Let me in. Let me in. No, don't do this to me. I can get it. Oh, I'm about to start freaking out here. You good? Should be five. No? You ate two and you're like halfway, so we should be good. According to the calculator, it's only take, it's supposed to take you like three minutes or something like that, though. Yeah, it says three minutes on kibble. Uh, you need to tame up so I can, like, get off here. This game is so weird. This is not the first time I've ended up, like, stuck on a tamed animal, though. Isn't that, isn't that just odd? Come here, Phoenix. Maybe if I can get you to fly over here, I can jump off. There you go. Right on. Okay. And now we don't have to sit there and stare at this and that, whatever. Oh, forgot about that. Yeah. I need to I need to undo you something. Come here, Phoenix. Phoenix is so awesome. It's my my favorite bird now. I don't know if I showed you guys this. I got a hundred percent imprinting because of the fact that uh, some guy brought me kibble whenever I needed it. raptor kibble. You're not hungry yet, bro. Forty two hundred. It's actually going to take a little longer than I thought. I figured by the time I ran around and did all that crazy stuff and got the kibble and I'd run back over here and it'd be ready to go. But, and it's been like over three minutes. The calculator says three minutes and 59 seconds. Oh, wait. No, it doesn't. Hold on. That's for a level one. 19 minutes. My bad. I had changed it to level one, trying to, uh, I'm, I'm working on thinking about getting an Ovi Raptor, and I was saving up dodo eggs so that I could, like, find me a super low level, you know, Ovi Raptor, and get it and have it walking around the, around the base and stuff, um, so I was saving the eggs, because if I could find, like, a level eight or something like that, um, then, oh, we got a Raptor, come here, Raptor. You're just trouble, aren't you? It's a 96 too, I think. Oh, good thing I have the fence. Pretty sure it shouldn't have been able to hit it. If it hit it, I'm going to be super ticked. No, it didn't hit it. Okay. Whew. That's That was ridiculously close. Uh, 
what do I need for more walls? I'd probably feel a little bit more comfortable if I had more walls up. Uh, can I craft some thatch walls? I can craft 17 thatch walls. Uh, let's just do like a couple. Or three. Let's do, let's do more. How about, let's just put them here. Because, like, if he'd come down through here and, like, glitched or something crazy, he'd have been able to get over the wall. And his first thing to do would have been to, like, hit this Pteranodon. And all it takes is one hit, and then you're just pretty much ruined on your perfect team. This would be my... I'm pretty sure this will be my first ever perfect team. Uh... What do I need for another Fins Foundation? I want to quit, put one up real quick. It's probably just a waste. Uh, you know... But honestly, to me, it seems like a good idea. If I can put one like right, where's it at? Right, like here. Put two walls on it. I'm not gonna worry about a door. I just I need the the most of the it to be like. Oh, that's crafting another one. Uh, I need the most of it to be covered. I'm just gonna put it there then. But man, that was that was whew. makes you nervous, man. Makes you nervous. Like I said, I've never gotten a pure a perfect team before. Uh, it should be. It should only take the two, right? Yeah, it's, the calculator says five, and that was what was sitting in the pot when I got back. So that's what we're gonna go with. And when I came over to put the walls up, I like dosed him up real good on tor on uh, narcotics. So hopefully, I'm gonna put you on passive right quick. That way, uh, if something does like, because that's that's just my luck. I've had that before, to where I had a 120 uh, or a 116 or something like that, and the dino I was riding ended up getting hit by bugs or something, and then it starts like freaking out, and then it hits my tame. So. She can take a few hits. Plus, it's better. Like I always find it better to leave the bird I'm flying with on tank on passive. That way, uh, when it when me or it gets hit, then it doesn't like jump up and fly in the air. Because that's like the worst case scenario. Because you can't ever get to it then. Then you're running around on the ground trying to get away from whatever's trying to kill you. Yeah, you can see all my little, <laughs> all my water stuff. I was like freaking out trying to get everything into the pot, and you know forgot I needed medjo berries and fiber and oh it's good stuff it's a rush it's a rush man uh, I keep thinking maybe I need to leave it and go get another kibble but I think I think five's gonna do it I'm like super psyched and it's a female like I don't know what all we're gonna do with her it's probably not gonna be a lot okay she's probably just gonna be sitting at the base uh, and basically her use is going to be she's going to be super fast and have tons of stamina and basically if I'm out messing around or whatever and I end up dying and my birds or any of my dinos are left out there fighting or something like that then when I respawn I can throw on a bit of armor or something like that uh, oh yeah we don't need any more one more is going to do it uh, but I can throw on a bit of armor jump on this girl and just fly out there super fast and get there and just wreck stuff so we're gonna it's gonna be like stamina movement speed and maybe a little bit of melee in case I gotta do some fighting when I get there cause like if I leave one if I leave my bird here on passive and it's just sitting there like you know whatever when I get there I'm gonna put it on neutral but obviously I don't know oh it's like super exciting guys I mean I I've been sitting here wondering it's like man it's like what am I gonna do in my next episode I don't know. It's like maybe I could do an Obi Raptor. It's like, you know, I keep, uh, you know, I've seen this video and, you know, about how Obi Raptors, you know, boost your, uh, the amount of eggs you get because it, like, some kind of torp, like, some kind of whatever pheromone or something like that. Um, we're gonna dope you again. I definitely don't want you waking up. Is that a drop? That's oh, a drop right next to me. That's a way to scare a guy. Well, I guess they learned about people. 
through X. You can put plant X through it's underwater? Or I guess maybe you could have, but now you can't. Dude, I could probably even try to like sell her for breeding. Maybe. Uh we could think about it. Cause the likelihood of getting another one like a getting a one twenty male and like having a bred a pterodon would be super, super slim. But she's gonna be fifty nine levels. So a hundred and seventy nine. Hundred and seventy nine to start with. You can't get any better. I'm telling you right now, you can't get any better than that. I don't think so. What's your food at? You're at 4156. We got another what? That's 50. Like another 34 still to go? Man. You're, you're just killing me, bird. I was sitting there thinking 3 minutes, but then when I changed the calculator, it says 20 minutes. So that's a pretty good difference. Uh, I got Phoenix though. Phoenix is up to 535% melee damage. I mean that, she is just killing it. I mean I'm just wrecking stuff all over the place. You know. Uh, let's see, I better Gamma. There we go. Nice bright, sunshiny day. I'm not even going to go to that drop. I'm not leaving this bird until she is up. I don't want anything to hit her. Got all my walls up. The walls I don't have up. Phoenix is on the other side, standing guard. Uh, I don't even know what I'm going to call this thing, but we're, we're going to get it. I still haven't even named my Megalosaur Megaloceros or whatever. Because I just did that episode like two hours ago. Are you almost there? You're at 70. 10 points. 9 points. 8 points. We're like right there. We're like right there. A female pterodon. Perfect tame. Um. I don't even know, man. I have no idea. Maybe, maybe name it Wonderful Perfection. Random Perfection. I don't know. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Oh. Wow, I am like super psyched right now. What are you? Let's see. 1554 health. 960 stamina. That's, that, I think that's pretty decent. 245 melee. 136% point, 136.5% movement speed. That, that is just crazy. Alright, can we just, we just need to destroy all this. We, we don't really need the resources either, so. We can just destroy the bottom stuff just to get rid of it. Because I've already got, like, now that i got a mammoth and I got, I've went out a few times on, um, oh, Mr. Waddles. I'm actually thinking about, um, upgrading the base to metal. But I'm not sure. It takes a lot of metal, but I, I'm getting a considerable amount when I go. Uh, I just don't go that often. But now that we got this girl, we can start running the drops and stuff. Get some better armor, get some better weapons. You know, get some awesome, like, Mastercraft crazy stuff. Um, I am level 78 now, so we're almost to the point where we could do uh, underwater drops. I just have a couple of levels to go. And then we can do that. I mean, it, it's 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 working out. Wait, which way am I going? Yeah, I'm going the right way. Sorta. <laughs> I'm like, I am so excited right now. I can barely focus. Um, we're gonna go back to base and we're gonna get a saddle made, and then we're gonna take off on her and just do some awesomeness.
you guys here she is I got a saddle on her even painted the saddle nice red white and blue take her out for her first flight oh maybe it's the first kill oh <laughs> raptor's running it knows what's bad never like you bro you ain't nothing I mean, nothing, man. I'm a one, one something, 180, 180. Wow, that is this is just crazy. It's not like super fast, but we're gonna start, we're gonna start up and up at movement speed. We're gonna have just like a super fast bird, super fast. Let's see. I hit, I put one point into stamina already. Um, so it's over a thousand stamina. Movement speed though, I'm gonna want I'm gonna put it up to I don't even know what. I mean just crazy. Like four or five hundred percent or something. I mean it's gonna be like whoa, you know. So that's kinda nuts, man. I don't know. But yeah, like like I said, she's pretty much only just gonna be um oh right here at base. She's just gonna be sitting in here waiting. Uh, maybe putting out some, hopefully putting out a few eggs for me from time to time, even though she doesn't have a mate. Um, I'm probably not going to get her a mate, just because it's already fairly crowded inside. Um, but she's just probably going to sit over here in this corner or something. And just kind of wait. Um, actually, I think she's got to be over this way. That's what I can use this little cubby for. This little hole. Um. Let's 
Look at that. Yeah. Got my emergency pteranodon up in there. But yeah, that's going to be it for now. I, I might do I might do a little bit of building or something here in a little bit. Um, you know. Got my bugs fenced in too. I, I didn't show you guys that. Because I was like, I came up here and there was only three out of the four of them up here. George Harrison. Where's he at? Right here, the sneaky devil. George Harrison there somehow made his way downstairs and then crawled into the floor. He, he was like in the basement or something, but these 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 sneaky little bugs, man, you can't you can't do nothing with them. They're just they're just conniving little boogers and they just go everywhere. You know, it's like having spiders in your house. They're just all over the place. But I've gotta go eat dinner. I might do some more stuff here in a little bit, add it to the end of the video. But we'll see. I don't know. Uh, I'll be back in a little bit. You get, for you guys, it'll only be a second. But all right, see you a little bit. All right, y'all. I'm back. Went and had me some dinner. Did some other stuff. Come back, and I've been thinking. One of the things I've been needing is. Where is it? I need to press Y. Um, neutral, passive. We'll change this. I like putting on lowest. That way I can better position them. But this is a level 5 now. It was a level 4 when I shot it. But basically, he's going to give us our little, you know, uh, if I can land. He's going to give us our uh, mate boosted for our dilos. And uh, I'm pretty. I'm, I'm going to get an over raptor in the next episode. Which is probably going to be here in a little bit, because I think there's one over yonder I'm going to try to get. But uh, I got a little jewel in here. That's what I decided to call it. There's a little jewel. A little perfect tame pteranodon. With her nice, pretty painted saddle. I can get her out here. Whoop. Wrong button. But yeah, that's going to be it for me today, guys. I thank you for watching very much. Thanks for the support. Uh, hopefully we can build our community and get a little bit, get a few more people watching ARC. But I appreciate all the help you guys give me. And uh, uh, if you liked it, like button, subscribe button, all that good stuff. Uh, this is Mr. Yeah, this is the Butcher Man. Good day, y'all.